we walked the correct way to get here. And then when we got to the car, I saw a little foot trail. So I took the foot trail. The foot trail is way shorter and way easier. And it's a foot trail. And you're gonna see a whole nother section of the stones. So this is the back half. We were on the front and the side half. So this is the back half. And there's now a road that goes to it. Try to get it through here. I highly recommend this way instead of the other way. You can see all the new fencing. We were on the other side over there. Bruce and Remy went back to the car and they're probably like, where did they go? Look at the unique detail on some of these stones. The little chisel marks, somebody hand chiseled them. There's some old, some old grates there. How cool is that? Well, if you want, we can walk back to the parking lot. These are just staggered pieces and piles. So you'll get an idea of how the walk is. Here's the back of the maintenance shed. You're just pretty much gonna go right along the fence line. It's a beautiful walk. We saw woodpeckers and all kinds of birds. And down here, there's a stream. But as you can see, it's a nice, easy walk. Just follow the fence. And the fence leads you right to the parking lot. A little bit of a hill. I think even if there was snow or if it was raining, you could still walk along here. And so you can already see our car in the parking lot. It's just so majestic and beautiful. So like the path will lead you literally right to the parking lot. The other trail is opener and you could probably do a whole loop. There's Bruce at the car. And it's called the Rock Creek Park and Maintenance Office. Lots of parking. And I just went 
I just walked to the right of the building. The other way is to the left of the building and there's a trail, but as you can see, the trail goes behind the whole building and it's a lot longer.